Good morning, everyone. It is about 6.30 in the morning this morning. I did not film Shay and I's walk today because she woke up at 4 a.m. I convinced her to sleep in my bed for another hour. And then we went for a walk and I was tired and so I didn't think about filming until now. So welcome to a day in my life. Starting off well. Now I am ready for the day. I tried a new hairstyle with a hair clip and then, um, I mean a hair, sorry, I mean a hair tie and then a hair clip, a claw clip that you probably can't see. And then I tried some little clips. I'm not quite sure how I feel about them. And then this is the, well, I'll do a better outfit shot later. We are shopping in Costco and as promised, the better angle for the outfit. Coffee, check. My lunch, but I was too eager to show you this before I mixed it. She would like some as well. How we are prepping to film for my side-by-sides on Instagram. And I am trying to take off a sticker from these shoes that I got on sale. And I regret taking the stickers off, but it is what it is. And I don't have a camera, so I'm not gonna be able to film myself creating the content, but just know that it's coming. And I'm doing linen pants and different ways to style them since those are kind of in the summer. I don't own any linen pants, so I'm using my mom's. Um, but they're cute, so I'm just gonna pretend like I'm going to Europe and could wear this outfit in Europe. Actually, I probably wouldn't wear one of the versions in Europe, but you get what I'm saying. Okay, two side-by-side -side videos done. Now we're going to do my followers style me. And this one is a little bit of a challenge because I'm doing it with just things I have in my closet because I would never wear the things that they asked me to do. So we're doing Ashley Tisdale early 2000s. Wish me luck. We are now at CBS to get candy because we're having a little family Ted Lasso finale watching the thing. So it's Ted Lasso season finale night with the fam. And I decided that we should have snacks. So we have some Skinny Pop, we have some Cheez-Its, and then we all have candy. Like Junior Mints. Mom has Snickers and my brother and I have these sour bright crawler things because they didn't have Kit Kats. I mean, they had like the mini ones in a giant bag, but I didn't need that many. And I thought he would like it. And that is the end of our night. And of course, we gotta do skincare. Not videoed was me literally washing my face in the kitchen because my brother and I share a bathroom and he needed to use it, so. I did it in the dark and didn't really want to film that, but just know it happened. So with that, good night and until next time and or until tomorrow, we'll see if I decide to film more things tomorrow because this might be too short because my day turned out to be not the most interesting. Welcome to another day. It is currently Monday and I have the day off. So I am going to go get my oil changed. I am cleaning up my room a bit and I will be going to drop some stuff off at Goodwill. And yes, I am sick. So please excuse my voice. It's never ending. I'm just gonna continue to get sick. So we love. Okay, everybody, we are here getting my oil changed. So fun. princess treatment at the oil change place they opened a whole lane for me because it was so full so that felt nice it felt like it expedited the process we love that i just dropped off some clothes that i went through to goodwill and now i'm gonna go shopping in that goodwill so yeah i'm gonna take you along with me 
This angle is probably so flattering. Okay. Let's do a little mini thrift haul of what I found at Goodwill. I found something that I've been looking for for me and in my favorite fit of jeans from my favorite brand of jeans, but it won't fit me and it'll fit my mom. So you're welcome, mom. I'm very jealous. So we'll start with that. I found the ribcage straight jeans in black for my mom. So cute, right? $8. We love a good find like that. Hopefully they work for her. If they do, I'll be so jealous. I am on the hunt for, these aren't quite baggy, but they're a little more fit and then a little flare. But I love the way that they fit me. Style is the skinniest I'll go, but I want a baggy pair of black denim and then I feel like my denim will be complete for now, but I'll always keep looking. And then I found this pretty little thing swim cover skirt that literally still has a tag on it. How cute. I have no idea how this is supposed to work. Is that the front? Anyways, I thought it was cute. I thought it could be fun for some different content. It was like $4, so. And then I found this. I've been really into basic tank tops lately. So I found this little asymmetrical one, and I just thought that it was a really cute way to kind of spice it up. And it was also $3, so I felt like $3 was worth it. I have no idea what size this is. Hopefully it fits me. If it doesn't, I'll just sell it. So there's my little mini for tall. Um, I will obviously show you if I get anything else, but that's all I have for now. We're walking into the next thrift store stop. This next thrift store is really hit or miss. Like it's really on point and I'm gonna buy a ton or there's nothing. So like I was saying, that thrift store was a bust. Literally looked through everything and it had nothing. So I'm gonna go to another Goodwill just in the hopes that um we come across a good find because I have time to waste because the cleaners are at our house so yeah. the last thrift store also resulted in nothing so I guess the first store was it shouldn't have gone to the other two because it felt like a big waste of time but it is what it is it is a few days later and I feel like what I had filmed is a little bit too short so I am going to pop on and show you the things that I will be selling on my Depop. You can check out my Depop. I will put the link for my Depop down below if you're interested in any of these items. So first thing is this pair of boots. These are super cute. I love them, but I have a pair of white platform ones that I just wear way more often and I feel like someone else could get more out of these and will love these more than I will. So I'll be selling these. <laughs> Another pair of shoes I will be selling are these Urban Outfitter little slide loafer things. Um, I just have no occasion to wear these anymore. So a new home seems good for them. Hi, Shay. Hi, honey, you can come up here. My dog might come in for a second. Come here. Hi, baby. Hi. Hello to the people. Hi. See ya. <clears throat> then the other pair of shoes. I literally wore these so much, but these sparkly vans. I love them. I just don't wear them anymore. Um, I don't really think I have the occasion to wear them and I actually have a pair of shoes coming in that is also glittery that I will just wear way more than these. So these have done me well. I think they would do someone else well. So also if you need shoes that are comfy for the Taylor Swift Aero Store, here you go. Now these, I don't know how you say this brand, but I think it's they say you say it key. I would say it quay. That doesn't sound right. I don't really know. These sunglasses and the, their case that they come in. Um, I love these. 
here are them on. I just have more sunglasses that I reach for. So I figure why not let someone else have a chance to love these? Uh, <laughs> same kind of, vibe. I guess this is probably the same vibe of like, just let someone else love these. This is a Lululemon tennis skirt in really good condition. Um, it is a size two for reference. I don't play tennis anymore. So I don't really have an occasion to wear this. It's in super good condition. It's in, it's super cute. I kept it in case I play tennis, but like <clears throat> I kept it in case I play tennis, you know, very infrequently or the off chance I did, but I have been worn this in a few years. So I just think it's time for a new home. Um, we also have a couple bags. There's more clothes, but the bags are just on top. So we have this leather bag, super cute. I just have another one that I use more. So I figure if someone needs a cute, bigger bag for their laptop or something for work, this could be a good go-to. And then I have this super cute Parker Clay leather bag. This is genuine leather. Um, love Parker Clay. If you don't know what the brand Parker Clay is, you should look it up. It's a local brand. Um, here's the inside. I love this. I just, I never, I never wear it. And I feel like someone could love this more than I love this. Then we also have this brand new Madewell bathing suit top. Um, it's super cute. It just doesn't fit me quite right. And I got it when they were doing um, a big sale and everything was final sale if it was on sale. So, uh, yeah, like still has the tags on it and everything. So I just think that someone else could love it. It's perfect for summer. It's really cute. It's really cute. I really wish it fit me. So there's that. Um, another Lululemon item. These leggings these super colorful leggings i love them i've worn them for a while i just think it's time for a new home these are size two as well there's no tag in it but they're size two so yeah and then the last item is this patagonia jacket it does have a patch in the sleeve um, I have another one that I will wear more. I have other puffer jackets that I wear more often and I just don't need this sitting around. So there you have it. There's my little Depop haul. This video will be posted after all of these items are up and live. So please go check them out and go buy if you want any of these items. I will greatly appreciate it if you do. So. Thank you and until next time.